Hey, welcome back. I'm Jamie, and today we're checking out the Dimension 5-string bass from Spectre. If you've seen any of my videos before, you know there's actually only one thing that I really care about, and that is, what's it sound like? This is a great sounding bass for this genre. Now, granted, I probably reached for something a bit more traditional on the original recording, probably a P bass with flats and a tube amp, but it's it's all there on this bass. I mean, there's body, there's a mellow top end, it's got some mojo, so let's do this. I'm just gonna hit it with some old school processing tricks. We'll pull in the rest of the track and let's just see what we get. Sorry if this moment took too long, but I was stuck in my childish own way. But when you're on my left, everything's alright, and I don't ever want nothing to change. Baby girl, when you're mine, I'll make every night the greatest night. Now, aside from just a little bit of fret buzz, because probably I just didn't do a very good setup on this bass, holy hell, is this thing clean? In fact, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to make it even cleaner by running that same signal through the Phil Jones Bass Bass Cub Pro. This is the, the BG120. Now, we're gonna bypass the speakers, and I'm just gonna hit it post-EQ XLR out, because this thing has five bands. And let's just see how smooth and clean we can get this bass to sound. Feel it down in my soul, got me losing control when you touch me. But is it too soon to say what I'm thinking? Is it too soon to feel what I'm feeling? I can't help it, I want something more. Can't explain what I I mean, yeah, it's it's pretty sludgy because, you know, drop A tuning is kind of a hot mess as it is. So given the circumstances, I think this bass is doing a great job of being clean and articulate given the genre. But of course, metal is very rarely heard with a dry, DI unaffected bass tone. So let's do this. I'm gonna pull in the rest of the track. I'm gonna hit it with some processing tricks. By the way, if you wanna know what I did to make the bass sound this way, not just on this song, but in all the clips you heard today, then check out my deep dive video over on Patreon.
that's what the Spectre Dimension 5 sounds like. And I just want to say a big thank you to Zounds for actually loaning me this bass and all of the gear that I use to make these videos. So if you like what you hear, you want to get one for yourself, please just click on any of those links in the description. And yes, I get a very small commission out of it. So thank you for helping to support the channel. Right. So that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you to my wonderful patrons over on Patreon. And in particular, these names right here, y'all are the MVPs. Please remember to like and subscribe. Turn on those notifications. Go buy some merch or come support the show on Patreon. Thanks again for watching. I appreciate you and stay well. See you next time.